right guys, so we're gonna go through a little chute pack here. These are Simpson air launch chutes. So first of all, we're gonna untangle the damn lanyard on it because it was all messed up. And this one has to go. These boys just fuck this thing all up here. We're gonna separate the chute into its individual uh, canopy section so there's no tangles back here. And then I like to put my fingers in these loops here and then just make this a nice straight little piece. This is called a deployment bag. And we're gonna fold this up and put this in the deployment bag and put all of the cords on top of the canopy. Why don't you do it and I'll show you how to go through the whole process. So okay. remember what we're gonna do is separate that and then we're gonna grab it up there, make it kind of a uh, folded sheet and then bunch those together right there. Yep, now take it up there and lay it flat. So we're gonna lay this thing flat on its side here, get it all nice and straight, see how it's all laid out real nice. This chute's brand new, so it's real slick. So uh, deployment bag hooked up here. We're gonna take this, fold it in half, just like this. We're gonna make this about the size of this deployment bag or about the size of the chute, which is nine by nine, the pack's nine by nine. So we're gonna crisscross fold this so that this ends up on top and then this is going in the deployment bag first. So, so we're gonna start here at the back and then we're just gonna fold it and then pick it up and fold it over on itself and try to keep it in that nine by nine shape like this. And then this on the bottom, okay? So now we got this packed up here. This goes right in the center of this and then we're just gonna flip this over Put this in here just like that. Then we're just gonna pull up on the sides of the bag and stuff it down in there. All right. Okay, so now we got it stuffed in there. Pretty neat. And then uh, when we put this in, um, the this flap is back here. We want our uh, we want the, the pull cord part of this, this extension cord to be on this inside of the bag because this is the right chute. So we're gonna start here over on this side we're just going to zigzag this back and forth, okay? Just like I showed you before. So keep it nice and tight there. And you got to kind of keep it over so you can get it all in one row. We're going to just zigzag it back and forth. And we're going to end up on the other side right about here with this little protective cover sticking out of that bag. So as you're doing this, you want to keep it nice and straight and just work your way across the top of that canopy. And that way this will come out nice and easy. You might have to go back and tuck it back in if you get a little loose. It's kind of hard to get it all in the bag, but he's doing a good job here. We want to end up with about as much hanging out as we need, so we have to get a little closer here and get this about like this because we, want, we only want this much sticking out, so we don't want too much hanging out of the back. So, so we've got that zigzag back across. So we're going to take this flap. We're going to tuck this in right here. Okay. So now we've got this nice and straight. Now these have air launchers on them. So uh, we use a little uh, momentary switch here. So this still has pressure on it because this pushed the chute out. So the CO2 bottle is off right now. So we're gonna push this and bleed this down and push this all the way in. So we're ready to set that chute up in there. Bud's gonna grab the handle and let the cord hang out. So we got this, we're gonna put this through this little loop here all right so we'll be ready for that now we're gonna pick this up and we're gonna put this in just like this so this is gonna go just like this so this flap is going right towards that cylinder with the logo and this knot the ba basically the back of the deployment bag pointing out so we're gonna fit this up in here and then we're gonna pull these flaps up Okay, that looks good. So now we got this here. So we'll go down through this bottom flap, tuck that up tight. Okay, then we wanna to go to the inside. We wanna do the outside last. So we'll go to the inside flap. Okay, and then we'll go to this outside flap. And then we're gonna slip this cord in there, the release cable, we'll pull this out. So 
<clears throat> the reason I do this outside last is because that's where my release cable is. And uh, you can see by the tension of the bag that it's pulling the loop tight to the outside. See, if I would have done this inside last, this loop would have been over here and this would have been out here. We want to see how it's pulling it tight. It's all nice and tucked in there. When he pulls this, that, this inner cable is going to disappear inside here. So this is kind of pulling that lip tight so that it uh, won't come out on the run. So we've got this is good here. We got both these are even like that. Kind of square it up, make it look nice. Put this back here on the back and you're done.